mission going in to finally take out the assassin in her lair now that I finished warden armor everybody has powered armor so for this mission I am bringing along my sniper that is bonded with my reaper my reaper will be doing a lot of scouting on this mission um, when you attack the uh, chosen you go through a two-stage mission the first part of the mission is a whole separate level I try to sneak through and avoid as many battles as I can um, and it's much easier to do that if you have your Reaper scouting for you. Of course, for their loadout, armor piercing on my sniper is always a spider suit for more mobility. Um, giving a dragon rounds to uh, the Reaper, just mostly for the plus one damage. Um, this Reaper now, if it scores a kill, it doesn't raise its percentage to be revealed. So if it's currently at 0% chance, um, it can finish off enemies. So as long as an enemy has go by the minimum so damage four to five so the minimum four plus one five if they have five hit points or less and no armor he could kill them and not be revealed so and uh the assassin's faction enemy is the skirmishers so they do bonus damage so i'm bringing all three skirmishers on this mission uh, these two are bringing their bond mates. Um, this one, rather than bringing his bond mate, which would have been another ranger, this guy's a ranger, I am bringing along my Templar. Even though um, I'm not bringing along her bond mate. The Reapers are just nice to have when dealing with the Chosen. So for their gear, <clears throat> I gave blue screen rounds to my ranger because he can get two shots. Gave him the exosuit. So he has a rocket shot. <clears throat> the rocket shot will mostly be for taking out cover or the other squad enemies because the assassin has the perk that she is immune to explosions. Um, these two reapers have a volatile mix. Your grenades do plus two damage, so both of them are carrying a grenade. This one has a repeater, superior repeater, giving 15% chance of a kill with every shot, so gave him tracer rounds for more accuracy. More shots on target means more of a chance for the repeater to go off. Gave this one the uh, reaper rounds. Or Talon rounds. I don't know why I wanted to call it reaper rounds. Just for the extra crit shot chance. Um, this reaper doesn't have volatile mix. So I gave him the uh, Mimic Beacon, just in case things get out of hand. My Medic, of course, has Med Kit and uh, Skull Jack. And just for backup, uh, another Med Kit on this uh, Templar. So without further delay, um, here we go. Shadow Chamber showed that there should be 14 enemies on this map. In position to drop. Time for us to finally take the fight to the Chosen themselves. Intel on this facility is almost non-existent. In fact, you may be the first human beings to step foot inside these walls. 
This may not be the most ideal situation, but it could be our only chance to take one of these things out. Okay, people. Stay alert and remember why you're here. That thing dies today, no matter what it takes. Detecting a strong energy signature further ahead in the facility. There is no doubt in my mind that it is from the Chosen. Then that's where we need to be. Take pride, XCOM. Pride that you have come further than any of your kind. Pride that your death this day honors the Elders. And I need to alt-tab for a second. I'll be, might pause the stream when I do it. I'll be back in less than 20 seconds. Alright, and I apologize for that. Okay, so your people do not begin concealed on a chosen stronghold assault, but Reapers or other classes will. I will go. If they, well, not other classes, but Shinobis well, and Lawmore we classes. Well, expecting a sneak in here today. Let's take these things out. Looks like three enemies. Changing position. Tactical movement. They probably won't get line of sight if an ambush starts, but might as well go for that height advantage. Plus, I think the cooldown on a grappling hook is only, th yeah, only three turns, so... It's probably not going to light a sight from there. I can at least, I might not even be able to see through the door at all. Come on, this way! vigilant move, so he will go into overwatch from there. Okay. And you just get over there closer, so you can get into rend range. And I'll just move you over to here. My life is in your hands. Tracking on the tracking on site. Got it covered. Watch order confirmed. My senses are keen. I know where you are. I had hoped you would never find this place, XCOM. You have forced my hand. I can afford to give you no quarter. That doesn't look like it's a door over there. Let's get closer and find I'm out. I am trusting you. Nope, there's doors. I cannot enter. 
enter this room without activating them. Can you move up to there? Nope. There are no time limits on these uh, assaults, so it's no need to start the battle until I'm a hundred percent sure. As you order, Commander. And where he's placed, if they move up to here, he might be able to get his claymore on him and use the claymore in, with both of his actions. Normally, I'd save the claymore for the uh, chosen battle, but she's immune to explosives, so. I guess I'll use this rocket. It'll take the uh, shred the armor on the robot and end its overwatch. And also shred the armor on this, uh... I didn't do one dumb thing, though. I should have shot and then fired the rocket. That was my ranger. That was kind of not very, uh, efficient. The rangers have light them up, which as long as their first action is a standard shot, doesn't end their turns. I could have took a shot and fired the rocket. That was pretty dumb. I think that opened up sight lines to the mech, so that's good. 100% shot, and I'm going to use a precision shot, so for a chance of a crit. Hundred percent shot chance. It's one armor. Least damage you can do is four, so I'm gonna go for it. Cause it won't reveal them if it kills them. Zero percent chance to reveal, cause it was a kill.
go for it. Taken care of. Oh, he has lightning hands, or she. It's almost worth using it, but... Oh, yeah, Wrath, or Justice. 50-50 chance, I'm gonna go for it. The choice is made. This will pull him over here. Darn. Yeah, it's worth a, worth a try. At least it took his cover out some, so... It's I think he had full cover before that. Oh, you can see both from there. Oh, you can also slash attack. Oh, I didn't end up doing that. Once again, I'm going to try that justice but on him for the fallen nice nice he'll miss his next turn I forgot that uh, their uh, claws do that now could just kill him but I'm not going to Oh, good time for lightning hands. Doesn't cost an action. You will go. Yeah, whenever you get a chance to use it, you might as well. Four turns cooldown. Not too bad. Do a rend on this guy. For the Templars! I forgot, uh, she has sciatic, sciatic wave now. Now here's the interesting thing about the ripjack attack. Never mind. I thought that was a blue move to there. left. And Sputnik caught fire. Yet here you now stand. My brothers were correct. You are unworthy of existence. I go where you tell me. Not too worried about my guy being on fire, as weird as that sounds. Whatever you say. He hasn't taken damage yet. Just go over here and hunker down, because hunker down puts out. All set. If you're on fire and you hunker down, you'll be okay. I'll run you up to there. That should block line of sight through the door. The reason I want line of sight blocked, I want my Reaper to open this door and not activate a pod. Looks clear. I'm not going to enter the room yet, though, until My watch begins. he has two actions. It's under my watch. I will not waver. And...
Understood. Moving out. It's kind of weird placement. I just wanted to make sure uh, I didn't see this back corner. Very unlikely, but there might have been a pod over there, but it looks like not. It's interesting how I can see this room through the wall. I'd like to put the sniper there. So I'll have squad sight to there, but that fire is still burning. That caught Sputnik on fire. So I think instead I'll move All right, there. let's go. I should give him sight lines. I would run him to there, but. Close the door. No, his turns over. I'll keep a watchful eye. I don't want to risk running him up and then to here, and then it activates a pod that is right in his blind spot, but might be able to see there. So for now, you just move up. No, I need a Now. Shadow Chamber said there was 14 enemies. We took out four. Offered you hope. Your actions this day are an affront to their generosity. I am on the move. Now, just because there's 10 enemies left, according to what the Shadow Chamber said, there that doesn't matter once you get to the uh, sarcophagus room, because. Uh, they start summoning in enemies non-stop until you finish off the Chosen. Moving to designated position. enemies in this next room too, so I don't know. My next goal is to scan this room next turn with my Reaper. No Overwatch. Would it be so hard to trust the Elders? To believe for an instant that they fight for more than just a single world? That humanity is not the center of this universe, but just a small part of a greater whole. Okay, two chrysalids. I will reposition. That doesn't look too bad. I might even just go ahead and set up to fight them. Seems like a weird move, but she has a lot of mobility. So I'm moving her there. I'm gonna put her in Overwatch. No one gets by me. I move this Reaper up. Sorry, skirmisher up. Put him in Overwatch. So if something does come this way, I got two guys with eyes that way, two with eyes this way. 
Because he's got enough movement that that one space move is inconsequential for rend attacks into that next room. Confirmed. Should give him good sight. That's probably blocking to that door. Actually, it's a terrible sight. <laughs> it's a good turn to reload for him because he doesn't have an auto loader. It's killing time. Besides bad sight lines, but the redeeming thing is I meant to move my uh, sniper there. I clicked on the wrong guy. Go ahead and move my sniper. Nah, it's actually okay with right there. Reloading! Reload and steady weapon. I am watching. No trespass. Moving to Overwatch. So it's gonna ever vigilant move up to here. It claims that's not gonna activate him, so let's find out if uh, affirmative this mod tells the truth or not. Okay, good. Gotcha again does tell the truth. So he'll go into Overwatch. And I believe he's the one. Retribution that enter attack from melee range. So move him up here. A great distance. Normally, I would just probably let these chrysalids be. Just close the door and move on without them. But they shouldn't be too hard to kill. I am at your service. I am watching. I will not waver. It's far, but I can reach it. Heading there now. Come get some. Let's go! Let's go! On Overwatch! Wait, did they just go through a door? And still, the Elders offer you mercy, and still you resist. You confuse petulance for righteousness. You doom your entire race. Okay, I know they're just circling around. That's a dead end. I'm gonna scout this way. Volk says I am to obey. No place for you to go now. Whoa. Well, that's tempting. I'm gonna do it. How many hit points do they have? Thirteen. Now that I remember that remote start does not activate the pod. Well, 
it does, though. Go for Stand it. Stand clear! Beautiful, okay. Killed it! That was one of the two that was uninjured, so... Okay, nine enemies left. I know where five of them are, and they're all chrysalids. A useful aid. Hopefully it doesn't activate another pod. Okay, and he sells both actions because grappling hook is free. So that pod's down. So, I've killed 8 of 14 enemies. So 6 left. There's 2 over here. I bet you the last group is a pod of 4 in the uh, teleportation room. I wish I could see them from there. Oh, interesting. It does show the reveal, even though they don't actually have line of sight on them, they're just revealed by a uh, combat marking or what is it called? Target definition, which makes them stay permanently visible. If that's the case, I'm going to move her to here. Put her in Overwatch. No one will slip past. I'm gonna leave him there because they both could get two shots when those around the corner next to him. I await their approach. So for he might be able to get there. Back online! Affirmative, covering now. That's affirmative. On overwatch. It is not our will that you suffer. Humanity's sacrifice will be great, but so too shall be its rewards. Submit to me now, XCOM. Ensure the future of your people. My sniper up to here. Tell by the floor that's the tele the uh, transport room. So we'll have to go through here, then to the left. I could just leave behind those two chrysalids, but nah, I'm gonna kill. Moving out. I heard chrysalids in my left speaker. I was looking that way, so... This map seems to be really chrysalid heavy. I will watch. I will 
Moving on target. Scanning. We are not the monsters. Are you really just gonna walk back to kill and destroy? You project your own failings upon us. You blame yourself for the truth. Looks pretty clear over here. I go where you tell me. Only reason I'm checking over there is so when everybody else comes around into this room. We head that way. I want to make sure something isn't going to come up from behind. That's the edge of the world, so... Yeah, that's all clear that way. Just out of line of sight is blocked. Now the turn they activate, I don't believe they can attack. The chrysalids, that is, so. Roger that. Let's move! Let's move! No ah, dang it. I didn't move him yet. I'm on it. I await their Our launch begins. There we go. We must not fail. Five enemies left on the map. One of them is that remaining chrysalid. I'm sure the last four will be a pod. I hate it when the game freezes up like this. I offer peace, XCOM. Not for you. Your lives are forfeit. But for your children's children. Surrender, and they may yet live. The entire universe will survive. All my skirmishers had that. I will reposition. Yeah, I'm Not pretty certain the last four are going to be one pod. Rock and roll. Ready. Up here. Yeah. 
Normally I wouldn't end in the open, but I doubt a pod's going to run around through this door and into here and reveal before my next turn. And I always give my, uh, always give skirmishers the um, superior autoloaders, any kind of autoloader if you can. Since they can't fire twice per turn and the bullpup only has three shots, you'll find yourself losing a lot of actions on reloads, but giving them a free reloads of the autoloader is a very good use of that weapon upgrade. And always remember with free reloads, don't bother reloading until you're completely empty. That way you get the most efficiency out of the add-on. Not evade detection. Repositioning. And don't end your moves next to these glowing red barrels. They're explosive. So I end my move next to a uh, <laughs> forklift, Overwatch. and they can explode too. But the, the difference is those barrels are very brittle. Yet. I am at your service. Wait till I have both actions available. It's good to use one action to run in. Make sure you're in a safe area that, say, ran to here, that it turned out there was a pod ring here and they're walking this way. That'd be a bad thing, but if he has two actions, he runs in, sees that, he goes, ooh, he can bug out. Basically, before committing to a move, you should always plan how to take that move back. a big mo mobility bonus since it doesn't use any actions and it recharges every three turns so a confident approach I am watching location confirmed scanning Signature directly ahead. This appears to be an alien transport device of some kind. Understood. Looks like we found our way out of here. Okay, this room looks clear. I won't move to that spot, but this spot. If a pod moves through the door, they don't usually get that close go. to the edges. You cannot run. There they are. Oh, wow. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10 of 14 enemies on this uh, map have been chrysalids. I've never seen that many. Very strange. Get 
Getting it done. Just move her to there. I can cover it. She'll blade storm any that get adjacent. If they do. There's better sight lines from there. Actually that's full cover, so it blocks his line of sight. It's better to move him there. My sniper, I'll move to here. Follow me! Covering distance. A long run. Got it. I'm on it. You can never escape my sight. I think that's explosive. I might be able to remote start it. Maybe not. Volk says I am to obey. Do it. Our world is dangerous. They might scuttle close enough to reveal it. Ah, they did it though. Go ahead and use this lightning hands. Actually, first. A psionic wave. Now, oh, I could do that and just hit all of them. Ah, save the lightning hands. We're just gonna do this. Suffer my rage. That was the most badass claim your power for the Earth. psionic wave I've seen. <laughs> Full focus now. Wow, that was that was easy. I'm like nine hundred percent sure oh, cool. that that was the last of the enemies. But we'll go Reloading. ahead and use this turn to On Overwatch. Watch order confirmed. reload people that need reloaded. Headed there now. I still have my claymore too. Most, I think I've used one grenade. I will not waver. I go where I am needed. And go look over here just in case. Yeah, this room's clear. Start to the transport. I see the path. Now the uh, assassin is Going immune out. to explosive damage, but the claymore and grenades they'll still be useful because go, she go, summons go. in from portals. Seems like you always run into a dromedons and uh, Max. Come on, go! I must run. Advancing quickly. Affirmative. Covering now. I am on the move. I go quickly. Moving to designated coordinates. Yes. Now, if you ever are on one of these missions and you have somebody who's heavily wounded, when you activate the teleport, the ascension gate rather, everybody on it goes to the next level. Anybody who's left behind isn't lost, but they'll be sent back to the Avengers. So if you ever have bad luck on this first section, get somebody that's really injured, you don't have to send them to the next area. Okay, everybody's on the platform. I think everything's. Make sure everything's uh, no longer a cooldown. 
one turn on that slash. That's fine. Well done, Menace One Five. See you on the other side. No height. We're in the belly of the beast now, people. Proceed carefully. What is that? Some kind of stasis chamber for the Chosen? No wonder they keep coming back at us despite everything we throw at them. <clears throat> A little disappointed because I don't see height anywhere in this room. A your task. A fitting epitaph for your race. May you be remembered. What's annoying that there's no height is her weakness is that she's vulnerable to height. Let's scout ahead. Life is in your hands. The time for hiding is over. The invaders send a patrol. As far as I can tell, seems like there's always two a pod of two. They'd start a overwatch.
cover me. Reloading. I wish I knew how far he could walk forward without activating the assassin. Oh, he can see him from there. Go ahead and take both shots. Beautiful. Armor deflection. Free reload. I'm reloading. Need ammo. And it should be 10% higher to hit because of that. I guess not. Oh, he doesn't have that locked on. Nicely done. Okay, Let's sir, do everybody this. reload. Overwatch. No trespassers. Position confirmed. Should have ran him to there, actually. Back online. Non-evade detection. I know that's kind of the line of safety. Any space beyond that might activate the uh, chosen. No one gets by me. Oh, I should have reloaded. I hate it when I do that. This will probably activate the chosen to obey. Superior hacking, nice. And another repeater, always a welcome addition to the arsenal. Okay. Nice thing is everybody has two actions. Right. We faced these things before and we can do it again. No matter what happens today, only one side is leaving this place alive. Agreed. Let me double check her. Into explosions. What? You can never escape the lowliest of all the wretched creatures inhabiting this world. Look on your death today as an act of kindness on my part. How is she there? Fifty-four percent chance of that. Sixty-one. Oh, I'm gonna go for this one. Oh, that's right. She gets uh, her defense goes up after the first attack each turn. Well, let's get rid of some of her armor. Ah. 
Plus, uh, adversaries skirmishers should have done some more How damage. Doesn't really look like it did anything, though. 63. I might save these uh, whiplashes for any robots that get summoned. 58. Go for it. That armor's tough. Now the battle can begin. Okay, he has locked on. That will not be enough to stop me. Nice critical deflection. If you will suffer for that. Oh, come on, dude. Oh. How have you managed to come this far? Five hit points left. If she tries to do anything, I think my uh, Templar will end up blade storming her. Actually, though, uh, if I was 100%, I would just go for it. appears to be some sort of psionic capacitor, transferring tremendous amounts of psionic energy directly to the Chosen, restoring them. No wonder these things don't die. I'm on the move. Affirmative, covering now. It's not worth risking the reveal. It's a good turn to reload, though. For Cover me! Yeah. I'm reloading! You did not think it would be that easy, did you? I know where you are. Wow, she already healed up to 68 in one turn. Miss. First shot, Overwatch on him is a guaranteed miss. What? I take that back. I know nothing. Their uh, rapid lightning reflex normally keeps them from getting hit. God damn it. Damn it. Maybe they don't get uh, lightning reflexes on their scuttle move. Okay, go ahead and lightning hands on this. Just because, might as well get the damage on it. Worry about the running dry duplication. You will pay the price. They took out half the cover, too. damage to you do? 
Yeah, go for this one. You are judged. Not sufficient. And with your second attack. Okay, so everybody else focus all your fire on the sarcophagus this turn. Order's confirmed. On the move. I am reloading. Can't get close enough to get a shot this turn, so I'll put him on Overwatch. I am watching. He does have snapshot, so I think I can reload and then shoot. Yes. Normally, snapshot has a huge aim penalty, but these are guaranteed hits. Vector rifle so wimpy. Watching There is nowhere to hide. See now the futility of your actions and the sex you move to there. Your death will be merciful. Set revealed her. I will always find you. Only twenty four percent chance. I think he can get a flank. Yeah, he can. Affirmative, moving out. Target, minimal damage. I will not be deterred. I think I've had it with this stupid armor. Okay, excellent. Flank shot. And you can get a flank from here even. Nice. I might go ahead and do this, just to, uh, no. Dishonored can sink lower still. Only 4%. Your 
Does he have a grenade? I guess they've all used their grenades up. It is just the Claymore. I'm actually... I wanted to get rid of this armor, so... Soon our prey will fall. The sniper has, like, no hit chance on her. 4%, but... Always guaranteed to hit that. Excellent, that took out all the armor. Zero percent, might as well go into Overwatch. Let me go ahead and get it closer. Storm. It hit her. Great positioning on this blade storm. I so want to use face off. Where he can actually grapple to. Oh, wow, weird. Kind of want to move him there and shoot. Get that flank shot, because the first shot, every shot after it, her defense goes up. Nice if she can infer with the chosen. Looks like there's a fire right there? That's weird. Okay, first though I want to make sure I get rid of these guys. He's out of there. He can run up. I do a shot. Well, you know what? Just run to there. Do the flank shot. Headed there now. Oh, 
Oh, you can even do a Skulljack. It's really tempting, because it's an auto-kill. It's only 70%. event you're gonna go here 96 three go for the 96 the pain will only strengthen my focus a righteous strike Kind of wish I didn't waste that sniper shot now. It would have been good on the uh, sarcophagus. With the amount of energy housed in that capacitor, I fear the Chosen could continue the regeneration process indefinitely. I do not believe we can simply wear them down. Understood. We need to make destroying it our top priority. That's a flank from there, so I'm actually going to go ahead. Tactical movement. See what options open up on the grappling hook to here. Go ahead and try to skulljack this guy. Moving to access. Nice. Okay. Forty-two percent chance, though, he's going to take some damage. But he doesn't. Hack the planet. Wow. He Got something over here. Yeah. Nice! Another repeater. Advanced Scythe. I think that'll be good for my uh, psionics trooper he's been training. Got something new. Okay, you still have both shots. I can put them on there. And he hasn't gone yet, right? We're green to go. Please say he has line of sight. Dang it! Because he has a stock that does, I want to say, four damage. So I gotta get four damage on this guy. Oh, you can grapple too? Does it have a line of sight on him from there? That's bizarre. Did you shoot our Yeah, he shot that one guy. I want him to just take both shots on this. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I could just slash him. 89%. Let's go for the shot. I have two shots. I will not fail you again! or go for 89. Hellborn. Which one is Hellborn? Is that him? He's Hellborn. <laughs> go for it again. Effing kidding me. My weapon is almost depleted. Okay, teamwork. 
I give you strength. <sighs> Use the free attack. I hate to waste it on such a weak target. I just don't want him flank shooting him. Getting a critical. It will course through! Should have just started off with that. My ammo is nice, his hair trigger went off. Free reload. I must reload. If I could see the future, then I would have just shot. <laughs> Instead of using the uh Is low. I have no more ammunition. Except that nobody's teleported in on these two platforms yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and run her onto this one. So she might blade storm any that teleport in on that one. Look out! No place for you to go now. Ah, drama on some worst. Such bullet sponges. Oh, my Templar can keep it. Coming in from the sides. Tied down if I can. I have a be on. <laughs> nice. But I hate the Grey's mechanic. Oh, that's right, I didn't bring her bond mate. Yeah, so she can't reach him this turn. has the uh, mimic beacon. This is a good thing. I must reload. Okay, free reload. Might end up using the mimic beacon this turn. No way to uh Ready. No way to shred the armor. Only zero percent, so you're just gonna go ahead and shoot that. There's 20 hit points left. I am gonna end up using that mimic beacon. Whatever you say. Double barrel and ah, the accuracy. So you gotta basically be adjacent to him to use that ability. I got nothing. Take out the sarcophagus, I think she'll show up this turn. I can't take him out this turn, I'm pretty sure of it. She's gonna come back this turn anyway. On the move! Oh. 
That's it, I'm out. I'm gonna go for the whiplash. It is free. Even if I can't take him out this this turn, to whittle him down for the next I turn. Have failed us. First shot on this. Mimic beacon to here. It should Adromedons are not very intelligent. He should go for that. He's got a flank shot all the way from there. This would do... It'll never... Armor will always minimize damage to a minimum of one. So three minus four would be negative one, but it can't go lower than one. Six minus... If I shoot, it'll be one to two damage. It's hardly worth it. I'm gonna go ahead and bolt. Locked for all to see! I probably better just shoot the dang thing with him because he might have to run to cover. I'm hoping that's a good thing. Yes, the regeneration process has been interrupted. Readings on the capacitor indicate it has become highly unstable. Then let's target that chosen with everything we've got. You will create for this very purpose. Now go! That reveals her. Nice. The gift of psionic power will do nothing to slow your demise, Templar. You can't see her from there, but you can see the Andromeda on. One damage. Oh, the armor does armor. come back. The power of the god is not yours to wield. I strike for my people. Your power is nothing Harry. compared to the elders. Now on one hand, if I kill her, I think the mission just ends, so I don't have to worry about that suit. 
I don't think I can get everybody close enough to get 26 damage this round. You can do 8 damage total with both combat protocols. Ten to eighteen damage. I'm gonna go ahead and I can handle that. Double barrel this guy. Almost. this away from her, so I know he wasn't going to be able to get close enough to shoot at her this turn. Oh, come on, dude. I want to say... That's like 28% chance, anyway. I want to say that the adversary bonus is just double damage. Okay, I gotta kill this Andromedon before the round ends. Need ammunition. So I can't really hit her, but you know what? I think I can set an Overwatch trap. I will watch. Four damage, but it's money in the bank. It's twenty-two left. The elders are eager to join the fray. Oh, she's gonna blade storm everyone. to worry about those two guys so much because if I kill her, the mission ends. So if I can get... Where is, is she going to move to? It is only when death is on the line that a warrior is truly tested. My resolve remains unwavering. My purpose absolute. Okay, so she has 15 hit points. Go ahead and wrath to this guy. I deliver vengeance. I Fail. must focus my strikes. Well, in that case, justice. The choice is made. <laughs> Gotta figure out a way to reveal her. She has a lot of movement. A too, trivial so. loss. Easily replaced. <sighs> Closing on target position now. So 
not gonna. That's a low chance shot anyway. I'm gonna run him up here. Yes. Hopefully he reveals her. Nope. You'll find no shelter amongst the shadows here, Reaper. The target is marked. Where the hell did she go? Let's go ahead and rend. A focus strike of they go power. to parry. That'll get back to full focus, too. Another repeater. I think everybody's gonna have repeaters after this. Such weakness. Now you see where the chosen were sent to deal with this situation. It's 50 50. I'm gonna go for it. He's got armor piercing too. So if it would have hit, would have been enough to kill though. Uh, she's probably gonna hurt one of them really bad. Unless it goes after the Templar. That's uh, parry activated. Guess I'll ever vigilant up to here. Got it. Moving. to 10. You will regret your deceitful attack. And I'm actually going to go ahead and teamwork. Oh wait, no, don't. That was, he's out of combat protocols. My fear is she'll run up at the sniper and Use her shotgun or something. Ow. Grasp at the frayed edges of your life. I am the will of the elders. Their blade which strikes from the shadow. Oh, shut your mouth. You're dead. I will not shudder. I shall strike. How many hit points left? Ten? Okay, let's invert. Actually, how much damage do you do? Eight to nine? Okay, I'm gonna invert. So it doesn't end the turn. That'll move her up out of cover. There will be no mercy for you, Templar! Reload. Reloading! Come on, I set her up for you. Your training fails you. Your Templar could still rend. That's what I'm gonna do. Feel the power of the Templars! God! You are wasting your time, Templar. Fifteen hit points. Does she regenerate? I swear she was down to, like, 14 hit points. Teamwork. You are the worst sniper that ever sniped. Tell me you ain't serious. No, I am serious. 
So she is Delmuth. It wasn't easy, but we managed to pull it off, Commander. If only we could see the look on the Elders' faces. I usually don't mess this much with the posters, but a chosen is a chosen battle is worth it. Not very creative, but whatever. Think the elders will like this one? And only one person wounded. to fill our hearts with fear. The victory and I temporarily get a walk away. I'll be back in a moment. In history. A small bump on the path of salvation the elders have set forth for us.
and after a slight delay, I am back. Your victory over the Elder's relentless servant will bring hope to all. Lots of promotions. I like to see that. Okay, well, let's see. I like having Sting. The nice thing about Sting is lets you get a shot once per mission that there's zero chance of revealing. Though Soul Harvest can be useful because every time you get a kill raises the crit chance by 5 up to 20, but I rarely get more than a kill. Sometimes two with the Reaper. So Sting I'm going to go with for now. We'll save the AP for later, see what we get on the wild card track. Low profile, I always go, go for defensive buffs if I can. Can you afford rapid targeting? Because that's been highly missed. That one's so nice to have. <coughs> Especially because you get two shots of the Rangers, so your odds of getting a kill are a little bit higher. Though instead, I think I'm just going to go with Grazing Fire. Miss shots have. I think it's like a 50-50 chance to become a graze. Yeah. And any damage is better. Oh, but hollow targeting. Oh, but this is free, so... We'll go with that. I'm going to take hollow targeting, because with Falcon, the Green Beret-looking guy, it's been very useful. I wish, I wish all Rangers got it. And we got a lot of PCSs, so what does Macrophage do? It reduces wound recovery time and grants immunity to acid and poison. 20 dodge. Might get that to Shinob Shinobi. A glorious battle! Often stands no chance against our combined might, Commander. I think too by doing that it raises you get to give an additional resistance order. How are you shaken? You weren't even shot. Let's see somebody else leveled up too. Nice, Demon did. He's the only one without volatile mechs. All of the Templars are in your debt, Commander. You have done what none other thought possible. The death of the Elder's vicious child. Your heroics will allow my people to advance the fight against the Elders and drive them even closer to the Void. Stop points left. I was thinking of giving him this, but I probably forget I gave it to him. I think I'll just save his points for see what he gets there. And where is okay. Yeah, he doesn't have a PCS yet. Given that plus three the sigh of offensibility. Shinobi 
shinobis. I think both my shinobis are on a covert op right now. Yeah. So I can't give them PCS. They're trying to reduce the uh, avatar track. tell you otherwise but this is I'm the proof their bond of the resistance bringing you the That's real my, uh, news about the latest victory over the invaders we're getting stronger every day and xcom is making that the two poles i should have nicknamed them north and south <laughs> cuz they're the two poles aha i'm a comedian would be useful. Wow, no longer shake. That is the shortest time anybody's ever been shaken. <laughs> My siblings A minute. and I have had our differences, but still, I would never have expected either of them to go down like this. Guess I'll go finish this relay. What's the supply drop? 17 days. Setting course for the Australian sector. Get this relay completed. We can start trying to make contact there. So we can attack that facility and also get the uh, bonus, continent bonus for Oceana, which is instant contact when making contact. I love this fuse ability. But I always get my side trooper so late in the campaign, I've never actually got to use it. Sooner I can build that second cell, so sooner I can start training a second Psy operative. What good has their loyalty to you done then? Will That's you a short flight. <laughs> enemies. I'm going to pause the video for a moment. I'll pause it in a, about a minute so this will 